As you may already know, Hardhat recently released a new plugin called Toolbox to smooth the process of development by bundling the most commonly used packages into one. However, this has probably resulted in confusion for new devs as they are hit with unexpected error messages. In this video, I'm showing you how to quickly apply this patch to your existing Hardhat projects and go over some of its nuances. If you're new here, I'm Ty, and on Eat the Blocks, we help Web 2 developers transition into Web 3. Hardhat Toolbox bundles the Ethers, Trimatchers, Network Helpers, Etherscan, Gas Reporter, Solidity Coverage, and TypeChain plugins. Since this toolbox does break compatibility with Ethereum Waffle and its respective plugin, we will need to uninstall these packages if we are patching an older project that uses them. If you are on NPM version 7 or later, you will only need to install Hardhat and Hardhat Toolbox. If you are using an older version of NPM or using Yarn, you must still install all of the dependencies listed on screen. Now that our package dependencies have been addressed, let's move on to editing our config file. Since we did uninstall the Waffle plugin, we will also need to replace that reference with one to the toolbox. If you haven't already, let's also get the gas reporter working by tossing in these four lines of code. The required API key can be obtained for free at pro.coinmarketcap.com. If you don't pass your own key into the config, the gas reporter defaults to a public key that everyone uses. The gas reporter will still work, but whether or not it shows you the fiat value of these interactions will be unreliable. It's worth noting that this upgrade causes a slight bug in your config file. If you've set your default network here, you will want to remove that because now it is implicit. Not removing this line of code will result in hardhat error HH108, which tells you that your tests cannot connect to the local blockchain. Aside from the changes and quirks discussed, the switch to hardhat toolbox should not be noticeable at all or break anything since all we did was remove the waffle plugin and make some minor edits to our config file. This has been how to upgrade to hardhat toolbox in two minutes. Thanks for watching.